It's just like a major setback for me and my daughters. Thieves carjacked a Milwaukee woman, then crashed and trashed her vehicle within just eight hours. The accused robbers slammed into a DPW vehicle as they ran from police. As 12 News' Nick Bohr reports, the victim just got her car back, but there's not much left of the vehicle. This truck was damn near brand new. Dulcie Perkins jumped on Facebook to show the damage inside her prized Mazda. The outside is even worse. It was a goal, an accomplishment. I didn't have to go and ask for a loan when I got this car. I paid cash for it and I was proud. But last week as she cleared snow off it with the engine running. I felt like a little thug. And by the time I realized I'm being pushed, the vehicle was taken off. When I saw my vehicle again, it looked like this. Police spotted the stolen car about eight hours after it was taken. The driver took off at 90 miles an hour and crashed into a DPW vehicle, injuring the worker. 18-year-olds Nicholas Holloway and Kyrie Staples are facing felony charges. Celsi says they were clearly using drugs in the car as well. She found a scale in the door when she got her car back. There's blunt wrappers all over the floor and even what's left of a joint under the steering wheel. She even found a pocket knife inside the driver's seat back. Whoever was sitting behind the driver's seat took a pocket knife and just sat there and cut my the back of my seat open for what I don't even understand. The vehicle is a total loss. Even worse, Celsi was waiting for her tax refund to get collision insurance, so she's out 17 grand. She's got to kick it off, shake it off and keep moving and Keep talking about it and making people aware to have insurance and watch your surroundings in the morning because if not, people don't value what you work so hard for. They destroy it. In Milwaukee, Nick Bohr, WISN 12 News. Holloway and Sables are due in court tomorrow. Both remain in the Milwaukee County Jail.